now we are going to fetch the data from the database if i am having any records inside the database only then i have to fetch so here first itself i will be writing no products available now inside this yes part we are just going to write our code our logic logic to fetch data below this i will be using one method i will just give my variable name as row i will be using my sqli fetch as so inside this i just want to fetch from here i have written my query here so i will be passing this as the parameter using this mysqli fetch asoc we can get the data present inside the database now here i just want to display the name echo i will be writing like this row this variable name you have to write and inside this square brackets whatever column name is present inside the database you can see i am having name so i have to write the name here we should not be writing product name what is present inside this name field we should not write that one we should write the exact column name name i will refresh my project i will come to view products refresh now no products available because i have deleted all the products from the database so i am having no products available i'm just going to add the product 34000 choose file i will select laptop add product product inserted successfully and i'm just going to add one more product mobile 65000 choose file okay let me give headphone at product product inserted successfully view products that products are not displayed but you can see here when i fetch the name of the product here using my sqli fetch asoc and i have passed this display product and when i display the name first product which i inserted that product name is available but inside my products table i am having two data laptop and headphone but here only laptop is displayed because we are not going to use any loops so directly when we fetch the data it is just going to display the first data which is present inside the database but i want all the data whichever is present inside the database so we are going to use while loop while and in let me just remove this and here i will open this curly braces i will just bring this up save this now if i just refresh this one you can see i am having laptop and also i am having headphone using this while loop we are just displaying all the data so we just have to use while loop to get all the data present inside the database next session we are going to display all the data inside table